Hi, my name is Katie and I work at the Align Life Chiropractic in Winnemac. And this is Trisha and Heather, my coworkers. And we are here to discuss our time during the UBC and how we dealt with it. And uh, I believe that my hardest day was day three, the fruits and vegetables. And I simply think that's because it was all mental. I was tired of just eating the fruits and vegetables after two days of eating the brown rice, the nuts, the boiled eggs that we love so much during the UBC. And um, I think it really made me realize that I didn't need to eat a lot of food after the UBC. My portion control is now under control and I don't need to walk into the kitchen and eat. I now eat until I'm satisfied, not until I'm full, basically. What was your hardest day? For me, I think my hardest day was day four, just because I was kind of over veggies. Yeah. But it, was, it wasn't bad. Um, this is my second time doing it, and this year was definitely a lot easier. I kind of knew what to expect, so it was a lot easier that way. Um, overall, I feel a lot better. I have way more energy than what I had to begin with. Um, I don't have a lot of the same cravings. Like, I still want a cookie, but I know I don't need a cookie, and it's more of a just, just a mental thing for me. Um, I eliminated a lot of things, the same as you said with portion control. It was a huge difference that way. I realized that I kind of emotionally eat, I'm bored, I eat, I'm happy, I eat, I'm sad, I eat. Yeah. So I didn't need the food, I just sort of recognized those things about myself. So it was huge that way. Um, I definitely would recommend it. I think it's a huge advantage. You definitely need to mentally prepare for it because it is definitely you know, something that's weeks difficult, but, but it's not, it was, it was, overall it was really easy. Mm -hmm. How about you, Heather? Um, my hardest day, uh, along with Trisha, was day four. Um, and again, that was simply, I think, because um, veggies are hard for me, especially for a whole day. But um, I did fine. I anticipated that my hardest day would be five, the fasting day. But I made it through that day surprisingly well. Um, it's amazing how you realize that your body doesn't really need all the food you're putting into it. Um, I was amazed that I could live without soda and without putting a lot of extra salt on things. Um, I feel great now. Um, and I even lost a couple pounds, which was an added bonus. Right. And yes. I will do it again, as long as I have the moral support of these two again. I think that's what kept us all going, right. was the moral support between all three of us. So we definitely recommend it. Thank you for listening.